this episode of Lasting Knowledge. Today we'll be talking about the Derby. The Derby is on continuation from our first video, the Oxford, as these are the two different lacing types that you'll see nowadays in the shoe industry. Hope you enjoy. As, as you'll see, I only have three examples today because I don't actually own too many Derby lace shoes. Uh, this is mainly because it's not that I don't have uh, the open lacing, but there is a difference between the Bulcher and the Derby, which I will get into the next video about. So as I was discussing before, this is what they call uh, open lacing. So in difference to the Oxford, which you'd see usually stitched at the end of the vamp here, and then the lacing splays open from that stitching point. This has no stitch point in the middle of the vamp. This is actually a, another piece of leather that is stitched on the side all the way through the back to the heel counter. So this whole quarter is part of the lacing. And that's what uh, specifically makes the Derby as opposed to a Bulcher. So these two lacings are then stitched on the side and instead of pushing from that point of the stitching on the Oxford and coming up, they wrap around. This is why they are perfect for someone that has a high instep, so nothing's pushing against the vamp itself and it just wraps around the shoe. And that is what a derby is. And it doesn't matter what kind of style, again, with the design, this particular lacing is a derby throughout. Mm -hmm.